Passion's charity Standish manages to conquer one catastrophe after another. Take a look. I'm such a fool. How could I not have seen it? Kay and Miguel. Lovers. It was going on right before my eyes. And I thought he was waiting. Saving himself. Like I was saving myself. So that when we made love, it would be the first time for both of us. <laughs> Please welcome the beautiful Molly Stanton. Actors, we always have to talk to ourselves for like monologues. How come? Ever. <laughs> I mean, come on. Who else but me talks to themselves? <laughs> you now have joined the club. Yeah, you get you. a you get a ten for fashion. Everything. A so ten. Much. Very cute. Molly looks very cute. But you're you're big into fashion, right? Uh, I'm a fan of fashion, I suppose. Uh, I run into you around town oh, at fashion oh, events. Really? Oh! <laughs> uh, yeah? Oh, no. I don't know. Anyway, so you've been on Passions, what, for three and a half? Uh, yeah, around three years. Three years. Since it started? Since it started. How did it all come about? Because you, you were... Well, let's go, let's rewind. You're walking rewind. into the psychic's door. Yes. Uh, yeah, open the door good. to the psychic. Right, you got to yeah, see the psychic. Yeah, that's how it happened. Um, ironic, because I play a psychic character on the show. Um, I was about to go to college, um, do something uh, more normal, I'm going to say. <laughs> more normal. But we do. Yeah, um, truly. And it was just all kind of fun. My mom had been to see this woman, and I wanted to go. So I went, and the whole hour was spent. And granted, we do live in L.A., so it's... it's I'm, I'm not, not sure if I'm a believer, even though we it take it with a grain of salt. It yeah. wasn't. It wasn't Chloe, the the the, the, the one that's uh, the Caribbean uh, one. Who's Chloe? The you know what I'm talking about on the phone now. What is it? Cleo. 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 Yeah. <laughs> the Cleo. Uh, so yes, I go see the psychic. The whole hour, she's she's very intent upon my being um, all over the place, or uh, so she says. She's very like, faced everywhere. Yeah. Blah blah blah. Um, and I laughed and laughed and thought, okay. And then I went home, told my mom, and she thought that was really fun. And she said, well, you should take some pictures and, you know, take them to an agency in San Francisco. Because your mom believes in, or not believes, but she has yeah. a strong yeah. relationship. Yeah, 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 yeah. Psychics. She's always, okay. always sort of been into things like that. And that's where you're from, San Francisco? No, I'm from here. Oh. But you so went to college in San Francisco? I went to school, Francisco. yeah, okay. at Berkeley. At Berkeley. Um, just for a year, and then I uh, longer, walked out. You lasted longer than I did. <laughs> <laughs> no, what did you go to college for? Uh, you know, it was my first year. I was undeclared. I thought maybe psychology. Um, I really didn't know. Because Berkeley's a big music school. Right? No, not, not Berkeley. Oh, different Berkeley. Berkeley. Different, different Berkeley. Berkeley. Okay. You see Berkeley. You see Oh, I got gotcha. you. Yeah. Uh, just is a good school, it's but not. Darn good school. My husband went to UC Berkeley. He did. Yeah. Oh. Oh. He went to Berkeley, and then he graduated from Yale. Wow. So, very smart. Very smart. Yeah. Smart, yeah. Yeah. smart. So, tell us about your first day on the set and what it was like to. This is your first audition. You got your first audition. Sort of. Kind, kind of. of. Um, I of... I had auditioned for some, um, some commercials. I had. Uh, attempted to jump up and down and promote Pepsi One. They apparently didn't think that I was the girl. Doritos, oh. like a thing for Doritos, I don't know. Um, it wasn't my favorite, those auditions, and I was sort of um, finished with it, but then they were like, you have to audition for this NBC soap, and I was excited just to have something to say. Because um, you're, you're rather, still at college at this point, right? right? In I San Francisco, was, you know, okay. I would leave during my free time and take my friend's car and drive into the city and do these weird auditions and nobody knew that I was doing anything like that because like, I really didn't want to talk about it with anyone but um, this is in Berkeley rewind I just come back from a run and my roommate was like your agent called because <laughs> they don't know that yeah, you're doing any of this right. yeah and um, I'm like uh, okay and I knew at this point that they had to tell me by now because it had been like the very last moment that they could tell me if I got this job and everybody just thought I was super homesick because I kept flying back to LA and oh. they had no idea you were auditioning because yeah, I mean, you have to audition like, like 150 Molly. times for a yeah. soap opera yeah 151 times yeah. and um, so 
I um, go, I, they tell me I get I have the job, but I have to be there the next day in Oxnard. Oh, like 24 hours. Yeah, and oh, I yeah. had finals the next day. Oh, really? Yeah. Of course. Did you take your finals? I took one in the morning. I called up my professors, and you know, Berkeley classes are 400 people um, wow. large, so. I'm calling up these professors who have never met me, and I'm saying, hi, uh, I'm going to go be on a soap opera, and I need to make up the final. Is that possible? i got to go fight the flames of hell, so I'm not going to be able to make the final. All right, more with Molly when we come back. Thank you. Coming up next, more with the marvelous, magical Molly. Welcome back. We're here with Passion's Molly Stanton. So, Molly, you're big into boxing. You're a lot of, you do a lot of physical sports. You're, I you're, do. You're a swimmer? I like to torture myself. I do. What, what kind of things do you do? What kind of... Um, I take a boxing class that's super, super fun. Yeah, it's killer. Um, I just actually came from there. And um, yoga. I... Yoga? Yoga, yes. That's where we sometimes seen each yes. other in yoga class. Um, do yoga together? We do groovy yoga. Well, groovy I like to yoga. call it groovy yoga. I like to call it rock and roll yoga. And you like to call it rock and roll yoga because they play music. They play great rock and roll or hip hop. He yeah. plays a lot of hip hop. Yeah. Hip hop yeah. yoga. Yeah, it's fun. Is that where you have to wear your sweatpants down to here and wear yeah. a Sean John, Sean John shirt yeah. kind of thing? Yeah, yeah. Yoga? A, lot a lot of diamond jewelry. I do this a lot. <laughs> Whoa, yo. What's up, yo, guys? Yo, downward dog. Yo, chaturanga. You also recently did, well, no, a while ago you did a show called The Dating Game. I, I did. But that, they rerun yeah. it like every 15 minutes. Really? They do every 15 minutes. Right? So you were really cool. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Th three, four years ago, I was. Four years ago. Um, but they're still into it, which is cool. Do people say stuff gets, to you now? Never like, gets hey, tired. I just saw in the dating game the other day. Um, I haven't heard that for a while. The last time I heard that, uh, it was every everybody at work, all the people that I work with, happened to catch it. Um, I did it. It was very, very fun and very silly. And I was um, 18. Wow. And I just, I had a really good time. I had a boyfriend at the time. Sorry to tell you guys that. I probably Sorry. shouldn't say things like that. Do you have a boyfriend, you have a boyfriend now? No. No. I don't. Oh, now, speaking of, I heard you're a reality show junkie. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I'm What's not your favorite one? About it. What's your favorite one? Um, I, I'm now... Um, Really super duper into Are You Hot? Have you no. seen it? <laughs> okay, but here's my question. Uh, no, this is, I'm not taking it seriously, and I, it, I, think oh, I, it, I There's it, no way you can take it seriously. I think it's awful. Right. right. What, but it's so awful that you watch it, and it's like, it's really a, a great indulgence. It's like I a think. car accident. You can't help but look. Yeah. <laughs> it is. Yeah. It's like a... You know, I'm a celebrity, get me out of here. Yeah, it's like a car wreck. What's the new one? Uh, how can we humili humiliate them now? That's the new one? I mean, no, I don't know, but that's exactly what it is. It's like, do on that. what can we think of them to do next? That's Here's my next. question. Do you have to be married to Rod Stewart? Do you have to be a Rod Stewart's ex-wife to be on one of these? There are two people. Rachel Hunter yeah. and Alana Stewart. That's right. Wait, wait, what? Rachel Hunter's a judge on Are You Hot. Right. What's Alana Stewart doing? Celebrity, get, get me, me out, out of here. here. Oh, yeah. I, see, I didn't question. want, it's like the only one I didn't watch. I don't know why, because yeah. I seem to be watching every other, every other reality show. But there's show. something else on television. Would you ever do a reality show like that? Would you ever do like The Bachelorette or something? You know, uh, no. No. Somebody <laughs> actually, uh, last night at the Coffee Bean, um, approached me from my network to do a reality show such as uh, the Bachelorette. It came up to quite you an offer. and solicited you to do a mm -hmm. show? Yeah. yeah. Oh, what did I you guess say? I'd like to do that with me. I said, thank you very much, but um, no. But hello, I'm on your network. I, Hi. I said that. Uh, not that it matters, but I said my network probably wouldn't be into it necessarily. Is there something about you that people would be surprised to know? I, I, I think there's quite a few surprises, but because uh, I'm, I'm crazy, yeah, I do a lot of weird, crazy things, but um, I'm really into music, so I, for a minute, was kind of DJing a little bit, and I, I play musical instruments. I guess that's a, a slight surprise. Um, what do you play? I play the piano and, and the drums a little bit, and um, I'm just, I'm barely learning the guitar, but um, music is kind of my my biggest passion, my passion. So, excellent. Well, maybe next time you'll come back and play a little, play a little something, play a little something for us. Yeah. 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 All right. Thank you so much. Thanks, Molly. We'll be right back.
coming out.